Well, tonight, neighbors in Brookline are remembering a woman who sweetened their lives for nearly 80 years. Ethel Weiss passed away last week at the age of 101. As Julie Lonchek shows us, her loyal customers are saying thank you and goodbye. We're all so busy. But one store. This is like the only, the only place in Boston that sells this kind of stuff. Run by one woman in particular. Oh my goodness, uh, where to begin? Taught so many here in Brookline to slow down. She was just this wonderful old lady who really, really shared her passion for what she was doing. She was nice and fair and very kind about everything. Nobody liked her. Which is why this weekend, so many took a moment to stop, <laughs> to read, to reflect about the life, the legacy Ethel Weiss leaves behind. She was one of a kind. This store was one of a kind. You don't see it anymore. Ethel passed away last week at the age of 101. She spent most of her days running the toy and candy store she and her husband Irving opened in 1939, where she worked until the last of her days. CBS News paid her a visit just a few months ago. It's a wonderful place to be, and you can see people all the time, and you can wave to them, say hi. <laughs> Since her passing, hundreds have come to say hi one final time. I think the thing that was most important in my mother's life is you always do the best you can. You live by the golden rule. I haven't known nobody that touched me the way that Ethel had touched my heart. As it turns out, Ethel wasn't just selling stuff. She was selling an idea. What if we all said hello, smiled? What if we all just slowed down? I think she'll always be here. She'll always be a part of us. Julie Lonchak, WBZ News. <laughs> Ethel's children sell. Julie, they aren't really sure what will become of Irving's, mm. but I think you can hear from all of those people, not only did they really love her, but that kind of place mm. seems to be going into the it past. Is. It and is. That's sad. But let's keep that one alive. Yes. This is one of a kind. What a lovely woman. Mm.